Hey guys, it's Joanne from 15 Spatulas, and today I'm making another drink for my non-alcoholic drink mini-series, Strawberry Italian Cream Sodas. When I was a kid, there was a restaurant my family and I always went to, and honestly, I don't even remember the name of it or what I ate there, because the highlight of every time we went was ordering Italian cream sodas. I just love them, they have so much nostalgia for me, and they taste like the soda version of a strawberry milkshake. Let me show you how to make it. The first thing you're going to do is trim the stems off about 10 large strawberries. You can hold them as needed with your knife. And then you're going to cut up the strawberries into chunks, and it's not important that they're an even size or anything, since we're gonna cook this down into a syrup, we're gonna be straining out the strawberries later on anyway. Add one cup of sugar to a saucepan along with one cup of water and add your chopped strawberries and this should be about one and a half cups of cut up strawberries. Cook this over medium high heat until it starts to simmer and then you're going to cook this for about 20 minutes. You're going to use a slotted spoon to mash the strawberries up a little bit as they start to soften. After about 20 minutes when the strawberries have really cooked down and the liquid is pink, strain the simple syrup through a sieve and push the mixture around a little bit with the spatula so the simple syrup drains out. And then pour the strawberry simple syrup into a container and let it cool completely. And by the way, you can use the leftover cooked strawberries by stirring it into yogurt. It's a really, really delicious stir-in. To make an Italian cream soda, you're gonna pour seltzer over ice about two-thirds of the way up the glass. Then add a couple tablespoons of the strawberry simple syrup and then you're going to add a tablespoon or so of half and half. And then you can garnish the glass with a strawberry. And before you drink it, you wanna stir it all together so the sweetness and the cream is all distributed evenly. And that's ready to enjoy. Hope you guys try out this drink. I'll be back with another drink recipe next week. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.